actually. This you is where I get most of my what? knowledge. Um, winters in Boston, Massachusetts are similar to ours. Maybe they're a little bit worse because they get these nor'easters. Oh, yeah. Yes, that's they, the they first thing I thought of. of. Yeah. That I remember one year when we lived there. Hundred. Why do they get nor'easters? Why does Massachusetts get nor'easters? It's the combination Ooh. of being on the coast and in the north. I think. Well, this is okay. The first electric streetlight used arc lamps, namely Yablokov candles. Oh, yeah. First used in Paris in 1878, and by 1881, some 4,000 were in use, and they replaced gas lanterns on the poles. So street lights, it depends on whether you're asking about electric ones or not electric ones, because they used gas lantern street lights for a long, 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 long time, and it doesn't even tell me when those were first What do you think of that answer, Brett? But there is a Wikipedia page called Street Light that I would encourage you to investigate. What's, what's really curious to me, Honora, I don't know which Brett is more interested in simply getting an answer or, or learning and really understanding the answer. So, so See, these are all things that I'm like, oh, that's a really good question. I, I, I would love to I learn know, more about, about it. Before I forget, I have one question, Brett. What? <laughs> Who at this table is an uncle? Raise your hand if you're an uncle. Not I. Brett is an uncle. You and me. <laughs> and, Mar and your dad's an I'm uncle. An uncle. Oh, I'll never In fact, be he's, an uncle. He's an uncle to Nora. One Wait. of my greatest failings. Right, aren't you? Yeah. Uncle. yeah. Wait, are you. John, you're not a grandfather yet, are you? No. Have you seen, you've seen pics? Wait, oh. But when you said yet, I was like, wait a second. No, no, no. no, no. I want to say Alex yes, John that I've met. Something in the future. Yes, who I invented street lights? You've seen it, okay. Who, John, have you seen oh, it? You know what? I wouldn't be surprised yeah, okay. if it was Benjamin right, Franklin, well, but that's probably the wrong answer. Three weeks. Um, of course, you know that, Mark, Grandpa Mark. He is three weeks last night. Last night, right. I, I won't know, know it that precisely forever, but... Um, yeah, let me... Let me uh, some pics here. So Nora is not an uncle. Nor will she ever be. No. Unless, wait, unless well, but I might be an aunt someday. Wait, if, I don't plan on it. If you had a gender operation. Reassignment. Mm -hmm. right. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, so yeah. It's yeah. possible. Yeah. So, so here's or I could just identify as that and then decide that I'm an uncle. But which bathroom would you use? Oh, oh 15, yeah, great. Right. It's so they cute. Have to have a on a baby okay. Uh, what's a oh, uh, turkey avocado? Here we go. Get things. We had to stop and get a pair of scissors because her um, her leggings were too tight and she had to like cut the waist. I mean, yeah, we had to stop frequently because she had to use the restroom a lot. I was at a diner about an hour and a half southwest of Chicago. Yeah. yeah. As yeah. heavy southern. Yeah. Yeah, it's weird. Isn't it it is yeah. unbelievable. Yeah. It and you, crazy. Don't, you don't have to go way far, way that far south. It's crazy. Now, doesn't Illinois border on Kentucky? It uh, does. Yeah. It does. Yeah. Yes, it does because. When we just drove to Georgia, and we decided to take just, you know, we gave ourselves four days to get there, and just kind of, you know, just drive where we wanted, wake yeah. up and be like, hey, okay, like, where are we going to drive today? We think we're going to go to, you know, I don't know, Knoxville or Nashville. Okay, well, it's rush hour now, so we're not going to go to Nashville anymore. We're going to drive around. Anyway, so we decided to stay in Louisville for the night, oh, yeah. and there was nothing available. So we're like, okay, we're going to go just outside Louisville to, um, I don't know what up these three um, baseball, like Little League World Series Not tournaments. No. And every single hotel was booked. And we were like, oh, do you have any open rooms in there? Just looking at us like we were crazy. So I pull up, you know, my phone, I look online, and that weekend was one of the tournaments. And it was a town that was created. They have like a water park. They have like something that's similar to Six Flags. Because all of the entire state of Kentucky and half of Illinois. It's so, like we had to keep driving further and further away. We almost backtracked all the way to Illinois. And we wow. ended up staying in a place called Horse Cave, Kentucky. What was it called? Horse Cave. Horse Cave? <laughs> yeah, Horse Cave, Kentucky. Mm. It consists of a truck stop and two hotels, uh, one star hotel and the three star hotel. So I stayed in the three star hotel. And Good almost choice. everybody staying there was Amish or Mennonite. We're not really sure which, but wow. there was like the whole exercise room was full of women in their full wow. like, gear in the bonnets and the dresses running like on the treadmills. And to that reunion in many years. Yeah, uh, it was really good. good. It was really good to see everyone. Yeah, I hadn't been since I drove with Grandma and Grandpa. Like, oh, yeah, when was that? I, think, I don't, I can't have trouble remembering, but I have to assume I was in college. So I didn't get my driver's license until I was in 
until partway through between being 17 and 18. So you went to that reunion? I, I drove them up to uh, oh. up to Minnesota once in oh, Grandpa's was, car. That was above and beyond a call of duty. And then I flew them up there. I flew up there with them once too. And that was after Grandma had had when her Alzheimer's was pretty bad because she kept like trying to walk away and like take other people's luggage because she thought it was hers. Oh, and like, Grandpa couldn't see or hear her. And, mm. Oh, and he couldn't do the moving sidewalks in the Minneapolis airport. It's so big, you know, like you have oh, so yeah. much spread yeah. in the yeah. airport. It was. I must have been in college at the time, so not since 2007 at the latest. Yeah, I mean, we've been... Brett, when was the last step Brett for dates? When was the last time we had gone to that reunion? Do you remember? Before this summer? 2002, when I was five years old. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess that was the last time. Wow. I really enjoyed it. Good. Mary was young. So, Mary, uh, Mary, Nora, um, are the Packers going to win tomorrow? Of course they are. The Packers are going to win all the games forever and ever, and they're going to win all the Super Bowls. Okay. I got it. Let me note that. <laughs> all you got to do uh, is just not lose. So, yeah. The score only strategy one, you need. What if Paul and John lived in Green Bay instead of Milwaukee? What if, who? What if Paul and John lived in Green Bay instead of Milwaukee? Oh, well, you know what? I don't know how much work my dad would have as a jazz musician in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Yeah, and you didn't think, think how far you'd have to come to meet us. Yeah. It'd be longer. But I don't know if they have a corner bakery Two there. hours at least. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I don't think they have a corner bakery in Green Bay. Oh. Okay. They do or don't? I don't think so. Oh. When I watch them do the weather for ABC Sony News Chicago, they only show the Chicago metropolitan area. But when I watch them do the weather for ABC 5 Minneapolis when we were at the Millers, they show the whole state. Why did they show the whole state? Um, oh, because uh, Minneapolis is a lot smaller than Chicago. And so they probably don't have as much to talk about if they just talked about the news for Minneapolis or the weather for Minneapolis. So they talk about a larger region. And it's also state. possible that people in Minneapolis are more likely to travel outside of the city, and so they need to know what the yeah, weather's going to be oh, like yeah. in the whole that's, state. That's, yeah. that Whereas people in Chicago are like, oh, kind of, we got it all here. I don't think I'm going to go to the southern part of the state yeah. today. Yeah. No need to.